A very warm welcome, ladies and gentlemen. It is time for game five of day number two from the PlayStation School Cup here at Pride Park, home of Derby County. And today host to the under 15 Smalls School Cup final between Ellesmere Port Catholic High and Langley School. Two teams coming out of the tunnel. Absolutely not wrong there. Tanamo, a lovely feat. Showed it and took it away. Drives forward. Keller making the run ahead of him. Here he is, the captain. Can he get there first? He can. And there's the game's first goal. Beautifully taken by Spencer Keller. And after five minutes, the deadlock is broken. And in a way, it's no surprise. Both teams have started so well on the front foot. And Spencer Keller with such a composed finish underneath the goalkeeper. It's Langley who leads. Well, that's a brilliant opener, and I think Tanimoo, lovely ball through. He's shown some great touches as well from this Langley School team. And it was just the way that he fed, fed the ball through. Spencer came back outside him to push on a bit. Launched forward by Langley. Tyree Simpson should be able to bring that down. He does. Pete Tuckerby on the right. Forward it goes towards Spencer Keller. Is this two for Keller? Lofted over the goalkeeper. What a finish that is. Two for Langley. Two for Spencer Keller. An outrageous finish. I can't deny that. Absolutely fantastic. Simpson involved. Keeper comes out, commits himself. Once he's committed himself, it makes the mind up for Spencer Keller. He knows he's got to lift it over. Lovely ball forward to Huckabee. There's men up here. Tyree Simpson just needs to pick the right option. Goes for the shots! Oh, you can call that the right option. What a strike! From Tyree Simpson, an absolute rocket. Top corner, 3 0. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Well, we've had a, an array of really high quality goals in the two days. And this is right up there with them. Out of his feet, cuts inside and unleashes an unstoppable shot up rising past Jamie King no chance in goal Tyree Simpson and here he goes again can he finish oh we nearly can what a save that is from Jamie King we saw a couple of excellent saves in the first half from that man but that's an absolute stunner that's a brilliant save that's as good as you see, as good as you get. Does this go over the line? Yeah, it does. He takes it over, doesn't he? Carries it over. Here's a save in slow motion. That's a fantastic start. That's brilliant. Might be as good as we've seen in this competition as a whole so far. Yeah, I do. Tanimo now has so much space in front of him. Look at those long strides. The pass is tied to perfection. Tyree Simpson. To seal it surely looks to go around the goalkeeper and does it's four it's two for tyree simpson it's langley school's fourth in truth it's been coming jamie king is finally beaten in the second half really composed finish uh, simple simple tapping still got the work to do look at the ball here Tanimawo. Lovely weighted pass. Time to perfection. There you go. Simple. What he has got is bags of pace. Reads the game very well. He wants to play the game, come out of defence. Simpson could be the hat trick for Keller. He brings it down superbly. What a save by King, but eventually. Spencer Keller is not to be denied. It's five for Langley. It's a hat trick for the captain who is led by example today. Jamie King pulled off heroics once again. But Spencer Keller finished that with the air of inevitability. Yeah, nothing more the keeper could do. Got to rely on defenders around him. 
Got to be tight with him. A bit too loose, giving him too much time. When the challenge does come in from Ryan Hughes, a little bit too late. Balaba couldn't get there. Keepers down and hurt. Now oh, they've been made, to, made to wait for their big moment. The full-time whistle will signal some big celebrations in the Langley School dugout, one would imagine. And deservedly so, it's been a stunning performance from the boys in black and white. And that's a lovely bit of play again, and Spencer Keller is on the way again. But Abbott allows his keeper to come. Rose brings it down for Ellsmith. And the referee, Rob Whitaker, blows full time. It is glory for Langley School. Five wonderful goals, five nil victors over a valiant Ellesmere Port outfit who gave absolutely everything. So final that was hugely entertaining. I'm joined now by the coach of a valiant Ellesmere Port team, Tim Holt. First of all, congratulations on a great final. What a word for your magnificent supporters. Uh, well, they've just been fantastic, haven't they? They haven't stopped singing, they haven't stopped che cheering. It's been a pleasure that they've come along and supported the boys. And what a performance from your boys as well. Ultimately well beaten in the end, but they did not stop running for the full 80 minutes. A real testament to their school. Uh, exactly. They, 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 They've got a really, really no, uh, good never, never say die attitude, and uh, I'd just like to say congratulations to Langley, really, for both both of us putting on a really, really good show. And how much of the lads enjoyed playing in a big stadium the whole day, the experience of a proper cup final? Oh, they've loved it, really. Some of them have said they didn't really have, have much sleep last night. They've been a bit nervous, but no, um, they've really, really enjoyed themselves. Well, we'll let you guys get off. Enjoy the rest of your support. Enjoy the rest of your day. Congratulations. And in Darren, a tremendous performance from your boys in an attacking sense, absolutely unstoppable at times. Yeah, we know our uh, strength in our team, and um, you know we've got some very, very good boys going forward. And uh, defensively, they work very hard as a unit. And it's been a, it's been an absolute pleasure to be with them this year. They've worked really hard at the start of the competition, um, have been outstanding, and surprised us all the way along. <laughs> That is about the fourth time today we've seen that. Should have seen it coming. Where's my vision? <laughs> and just, just talk to me a little bit about everyone in the team, because whilst you were amazing going forward, a clean sheet was kept, yeah. your goalkeeper had to make some phenomenal saves. It was a true team effort. Yeah, Ruben's outstanding. We mustn't forget the two boys that we've, who've played in the, the competition as well, Dante and Zach, who aren't with us today. Um, but Ruben was absolutely brilliant, absolutely brilliant today. He kept us in the game. We got ourselves a 2 or 3 nil lead. And he made a couple of fantastic saves, which kept us in the game um, and kept that lead for us. So, now myself, uh, Clarkey, Rob Newman, and, and uh, Sammy Morgan are very, very proud of the boys and proud of what they've achieved. We've only started playing football at the school really only probably 18 months ago. So, they're a great bunch of lads. They all work well, really hard for each other, and that's the most important thing. I'm very, very proud of them and the team that go alongside them. And obviously, you're used to playing in arenas like this, but what was it, what's it been like for the lads? Have you had to try and settle some nerves ahead of today? I'm, I'm, a, I'm a nervous wreck. It's a nightmare, honestly. I'd far rather far be playing out there. It's, um, it's hard to get it across to them, you know. We're from sort of different kind of eras and stuff, but they, they, they've done fantastic. And that's all we can ask for them is to work hard for Langley School, be proud of wearing that shirt. And uh, they're now the first team to win a, a national competition for the school, so they'll be etched in history forevermore. So and I'm very proud of them. And they deserve to be after a performance like that. Congratulations. Thank you. Thanks a lot.